Hey guys and welcome to another Laura and Nicholas video. We made it to the Pande Palais here in Saint-Tropez in the south of France and this hotel is super iconic. It's a little boutique hotel right in the center and it's actually owned by the Eral Group. They have multiple properties. We're actually visiting another one by Eral here in Saint-Tropez but we will keep that for another video so make sure to subscribe. Now let's start this tour. First thing you see when you enter the iconic beautiful doors of the hotel is the concierge and the reception and then if you walk a little bit further you will have the elevator and the stairs that will take you to the room and if you work further there you have actually a dining area or breakfast area so if it's a little bit more chilly a little bit more cold you can sit inside and you have a lounge area on this side as well and you do have lots of windows so if you want to have a look outside and see the pool and the main court you can do so and now let's show you because it's super beautiful so we made it to the outdoor area which is actually our favorite part of the hotel so as you can see there is a pool here in the center in the middle to be honest it reminds us a little bit of like a Riyadh in Morocco where you have like an indoor like like a little court where you have a pool just in the middle of a city and you have lounge beds over here which are one of our favorite lounge beds actually that we've ever seen it's just like so beautiful and modern and you have like little seating areas everywhere so now it's all set up for breakfast but yeah you have just like seating areas all around you can sit wherever you want and in the back right there you have a bar which we'll show you right now so as you can see here in the back of the garden is the bar so yeah you can order just like drinks all day when you're sitting by the pool your cocktails here are actually really really good what's really special about this place is the house in itself the building as you can see the only window that's open is our window <laughs> which we'll, we'll show you the room later but yeah the building is just iconic it's just so beautiful and we actually have dinner like right there so they set up like tables all around the pool for dinner what's really cool is during the day this place actually is only for guests so you can't enter this place if you're not staying here but at 7 in the evening they open the doors and you can come have a drink here have dinner here so then you don't need to be a guest and you can see this beautiful place for yourself as well so that also means that during the day it's super calm and very very private and then in the evening it gets it's more vibrant more busy so yeah it's a really cool vibe here so the next thing we wanted to show you is the spa that's actually being used right now by guests so we can't show you that but let's show you our room right now so we are actually staying in a classic garden view room so this is actually kind of the entry level level their most basic room almost i would say but you do have one with like a view on the village which is street view and then you have the one we're staying in with just like a view on the garden and swimming pool and everything and obviously you can see the village from here as well so once you enter you have this little desk over here you even have some speakers there's some snacks water and this we were actually a little bit confused when we entered but this is actually a tv but i think they made it look really nice so even if you don't want to use a tv it actually looks like kind of a mirror or something and then over here you have your little coffee station and here is some closet space so obviously it's filled now already with all our stuff there's a safe as well then over here you have the mini bar so you have multiple snacks so you can get those refilled they're all like included you have some soft drinks and obviously I strip hay. <laughs> This is really good. Actually. Laura's favorite when she was, well, not a kid, but when she was, when was a like teenager. I was like 18 or like 16 or something. But this one is without alcohol, actually. You have it with and without. Well, anyway, <laughs> you have a full length mirror actually over here, which we think is important that every room has that. And then the view we will show you later. Or do you want to see it now? You want to see it now? Okay. So <laughs> this is the view. It's double gloss, um, so you won't hear any noises at night. It's a little bit hard to open but these are the views that you get. Go have a look. Okay, that was it. And then here in the corner, you have a little 
lounge, like a little seating area. I'm not sure who uses that, but it fills up the room pretty nicely. Then this is the bed. So the bed is quite big actually, big enough, with some very nice bed linen. And then now let's show you the bathroom. So the bathroom is actually kind of, well, a little bit small because you only have one sink. As you can see, although there is some more like space to like put all your toiletry and all your products, which is nice. And then you have uh, bath ropes with slippers. You have a shower here in the corner. And then you have a toilet. Woo! <laughs> And you have a toilet over here. As you can see, like the room in general is pretty small, but obviously you're in an old building as well. And they only have about 12 rooms, I think. So it's like a pretty small boutique hotel. And then let's see here, actually you have some more closet space as well. So we do have quite some bags and they all fit. So that's really nice. And then here I would say this is more like decoration almost, but you could use it as well as storage space. And I think this concludes the full tour of Pandey Palais here in Saint-Tropez. We hope you enjoyed this tour and if you want to see more tours or if you want to see more vlogs from our time here in Europe, make sure to subscribe and we will see you next week.